All right, what's poppin'? It's your boy, Big Rich, Queens, New York City, where we get busy. I know it's been a minute since we did a mob story, but, you know, life and things happen. But we must conduct business, so let's get right into it. Ladies and gentlemen, come on in. Wipe your feet on the rug. Throw some smoke in the atmosphere. I just lit up some super sour diesel sunshine for the soul. Let's get right into it. Don't forget, Mob Stories is brought to you by Ruckus Radio Podcast, home of Mob Stories, and waking up with Ruckus every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday from 10 to 11, 15 a.m. Come check us out. Time for some business. This next article coming out of, where is this next article coming out of? From Euronews, wanted mafia fugitive and cocaine king extradited to Italy from Brazil. Salute to Odd Man Rush for sending me the story. It's a couple of weeks old, but, you know, like I said, I was busy, but, we, you know, we're back to business. And it's been a crazy month, right? Uh, almost a, a crazy 45 days. We lost Ray Liotta, we lost James Kahn, and we lost Tony Sirico. May they all rest in peace. You know what I say, no time for rest. We must progress. One of Italy's most wanted mafia members has arrived in Rome from Brazil after more than 27 years on the run. That was a great run. Rocco Morabito was number two on Italy's most wanted list. has been described as one of the world's most powerful drug brokers. He was convicted in 2001 of trafficking cocaine as a member of the Indragata Organized Crime Syndicate. Italian police have been searching for the 55-year-old mafia boss since 1994. Morabito was arrested in May 2021 by Brazilian police in a joint operation with Italian and U.S. investigators. Calabria-based anti-mafia prosecutors say Morabito played a big role in cocaine trafficking between South America and Milan, a key distribution point for the drug to be sold elsewhere in Italy and across Europe. He had earlier been detained in Uruguay in 2017 while living in a luxury seaside villa and using a false Brazilian passport. During his arrest, police also seized a 9mm gun, 13 mobile phones, cash, and a Mercedes-Benz. But Morabito escaped from prison in Uruguay two years later through a hole in the facility's roof. Rocco Morabito has also escaped arrest in 1994 in Milan, where he was nicknamed the Cocaine King. In addition to drug trafficking, Morabito has been convicted in Italy of Mafia Association. He will now serve a 30-year prison sentence after his extradition. I wonder if he has another run in him. I mean, this guy has, seems to be getting away from prison like a prison break. But still, they caught him. And they sent him back to Italy, where he will now have to do 30 years in jail. Not good for Rocco, but it is what it is. It is the life that we live that determines where we go. Big Rich, Queens, New York City, where we get busy. Like, comment, and share. Let me know what you're smoking on. Like I said, super sour diesel. Sunshine for the soul. Let me know what city you're rocking in. We will talk soon. Salute.